Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we are continuing this day. We talked about my dog. We talked about the break-in. Um, let's not talk about that stuff anymore and try to keep this positive. Come on, Stoic. The world doesn't suck that much. I'm, <laughs> I'm on the fence about that, but yeah, let's see. Let's take the treasure tracker. Also, this is the Brachidios quest. Let's see, how many days are you still here? Two days. Okay, so this is where you need to start making uh, complete decisions. Of course, the Argosy captain cycles, but this is before you fight Brachidios, this is the longest time you're going to get half off everything. So make your preparations or avoid Brachidios until you get everything. Let's see. I don't need to do anything until Rathian. Wait, these guys are back. So let me just... What is this? Broken Shell, Bathsite, Stone. Slender Fragments. That's for the Arshan armor. <coughs> oh man, I promised I wasn't going to do that. <laughs> I didn't promise anything. I can't help it. It's the way my voice works. Let's see. Let's go with that. Uh, we'll go with Moga Deep because all we have are fish finders. <gasps> Do we have a spear? No, we don't. Can I trade for one? No, I just got the treasure tracker. Oh, can I just send him there anyway? Dash extract and global hide. Not worth it. I need a wet fish. What's my farm looking like? Actually, let's just go. <laughs> I'm wasting so much time here. I don't even know how long this Brachidios quest is going to go. This bow is the uh, Ala Victoria 2. Ala Victoria 2. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm level 3 spread for 2 and 3 charges. We're probably just going to use level 2 because level 3 takes a while to get there. And... What are we gonna do? What am I looking at? Still haven't. <laughs> no, is this the one? No, that's not it. Where are you? Still haven't found any spearfish tuna. It's been forever. I think <laughs> it's like 80 hours now. I don't know, 70 something. Hold on, let's check my guild card. I don't even know how long it's been. Uh, there. Clobbering time, endless hunt, the decisive... Oh, I did a lot of sedeas to get some furs. Um, I didn't get any furs. <laughs> I did three of them and I killed them. Also, with that, with the ingot set and the spread level 2 of your bug bow and the lightning element, and then you can gem in power coatings if you have a double slot talisman, you can do the sedeas quest in about... 17 minutes, 16 minutes, just over 15. I know you can't do it under 15 unless you can, and I just didn't do it right. But just over 15 minutes, you can kill it. it, it that's cool, right? Just think of what you can do once you get the bow maxed out. And that's why I think you should use the bug bow against the uh, G rank Sidaeus if you're already there and you're waiting for some sort of tactic. I advise ingot, full ingot armor with those specific skills. Power coating plus, um, lightning attack plus two, and the pellet spread, because that's going to help out. You just need a do double slot talisman, or a power coat, a good power coating talisman. That'll definitely work. Um, so yeah, 80 hours already. That's what we're looking at. Oh my gosh, I forgot what I was going to look at. <laughs> Oh man, Stoic, you're wasting so much time again. See, I didn't get any fur. Like, I did. Th look how much hide I have. I didn't even get any more Elder Dragon blood, though. Three. No, four bows. No, is it three? I think it's three. Three bows need. Oh, did I already get temper? Did I just eat and I forgot? I did. Four. Three or four bows actually require quite a bit of uh, Elder Dragon blood. So, s doing Sedaeus repeatedly is probably a good idea. Hey you, what kind of dances do you have? Good. What kind of dances do you have? Wait, do you have a slot yet? Where's your pitfall mask? Oh, you don't have a slot. Wait, does the pitfall mask ha get a slot? 
I don't even know. Element attack boost. Because we're going to focus on element here. Water attack plus two with a 160 water element bow. What is that? 20% of... That's 30. So we have 190. We're going the wrong way. And this is the first encounter with Brachidio. So we're going to get a cutscene. I should have remembered that. Then we would have just started immediately. I brought close range coding combos. And I feel like I'm yelling, but like I said, the acoustics in these in this room, it's 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 sending my voice back to me. So I feel like I'm talking louder than I usually do, but I won't know until I hear the the thing, the recording. I don't know, but we're almost there. Uh, next one. Our next rank has all the subspecies, like all bunched into quest after quest. I don't think there's any repeat of the original monsters at all. I think there might be a Brachidios Giganox quest. Or is that just an online or a Tenzia port? So this is Brachidios, the new slime monster. If you haven't played the game yet, this. I think he was introduced in Portable 3rd though. But they just used try and in enhanced it <clears throat> to and oh man, I don't even know how to explain this. They enhanced it to have Tanzia port and you get all this other new monster stuff. Portable third, the Japanese game has everything. Okay, water element in the head. They they got everything first before we did. And a lot of people imported it, and that was on the PSP, if you didn't know. Um, not that that's important at all. So you can either aim for the tail, or you can aim for the head. But because I'm working with element, I prefer to aim for the head. Maybe I should try to get those pounders, though, because I'm going to need a few of them. Oh! Oh, man. Destroyer and that... That oh, oh, oh <laughs> no, that tail. Maybe an arc shot with close range coding. <laughs> That's the one thing I hate about close range. It's like, it's not as versatile as you'd like it to be. Like power coatings are. I also have high grade earplugs because I gemmed that in. Well, no, I didn't. I have oh, there you go. I have a uh, plus four hearing talisman. Ah, you can sacrifice water attack plus two to water attack plus one and jam it in yourself. And I don't know, there's a lot of combinations. And then if you have like a good anything talisman, you should, whoa, you should have enough for something. I don't know how long this is actually going to take. Ah, ah. Also, I maxed out my Helios armor. I think I forgot to mention that. So I'm not going to die as often as Brachidios would like me to. Because you're going down. Whoa. Did he take out Cha-Cha and Kayumba? No, they're back. Wait, where's Kayumba? Kayumba! Kayumba, where are you? I need you. I need you for this. Or wait, maybe I should just save that until he's like capable. Because what if I screw up my Shock Trap? I want to capture him, but no, if I carve him, I get better gems. Go dig! Dig! Okay, you're digging. You're actually doing something useful this time. Oh man, those explosions! I'm not going to be able to reach him, am I? Oh, yes I am. Yes I am. Okay, let's see if we can break this hand. We got the element attack boost. If they could give me a bonus, that would be sweet. But what is our element at? 230. So we got a 40% boost, or a 40 point boost from the 190 that we originally had with the water attack. And that was a far, ow, far shot with close range coatings. Doesn't work like that. Oh man, I think I, I barely got its toe. Now let's see how much Oh yes. See how much uh damage it takes to break this thing. 
we can actually get the tail. Like, I've done it before, but it'll probably take make the quest go like 15 minutes. Not fun, but if I need gem or if I need tail, I don't think I need tail for the bow uh, yet. So I think we're good without the tail. If you need the gem, I think killing it would be faster and then reinitiating the quest because the tail is, does not guarantee, and that's pretty obvious, does not guarantee a gem. But it does give you, ah, does give you a, a chance, a better chance at it, especially if you have to carve the body after it dies. Don't do that. Can't you be tired like you usually are? Whoa, those back hops really work. There you go. Yeah, you're tired. Can't you break? I have part breaker. <laughs> Come on. Give me a pounder. I just want like two of them. I don't even know if it's hands are weak to element. I'm hoping. But these pounders are pretty hard to break. So destroyer is probably preferred if you need them. Oh, there's one. Wait, that means the other one should be going, right? Because we have been working on the other one way <laughs> more than this one. Nope. Nope, it doesn't want to break. Oh, man. This is so hard. Oh, what are you doing? No, you're hungry. Um, explosions on an explosive monster? I think I'll save my uh, <laughs> barrel bombs. I think the one thing I'm going to miss while recording these videos is my dog snoring. <laughs> he does that. He gets really bored. And wow, this arm. There you go. Okay, just keep attacking. Water in the face, bullet. In, no, water in the horn, bullet in the face. That's how it. That's how it always goes. That's mostly what I remember from ice actually he actually might be capable might be maybe probably not so this quest isn't too difficult with the appropriate setup I mean you got the occasional uh, dodging and monster spamming moves oh <laughs> hey you die right there please be a strong enough explosion Oh man, how does how does he get to survive that and I get like massive damage from ah ah, 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 ah. massive damage from those attacks. Oh, this is so hard. No, it's not. I'm just whining because of how long it's taking. I honestly don't know how long this is going to take. I've never actually used this tactic with the level 2 charge cuz technically you're dealing more damage due to time. Uh, time, time, using time wisely. Because if you did a full charge like this, you know how long that takes. Oh, man. Ah, I thought it flinched. That was my bad. Oh. Oh man, I'm getting a little quiet here because this is getting a little intense. I'm trying to contemplate if I should... Oh no. Oh, I'm okay. I'm trying to decide if I should heal or let Cha-Cha heal me. Thank you! You're so nice. Sometimes. <laughs> How are you not dead? Oh, you just got like triple pounded. This game cheats. I hate this. Whoa. No! Oh, that counterattack is just ridiculous. Well, it's not really a counterattack. What would you call that? It's like. It's like a. I'm gonna hit here. And then I'm not gonna. Then I'm gonna turn around immediately and. It's like a double whammy. No, you're done. You need to stop fighting now. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're done. Oh, I missed! Ah, oh, that tail! Oh, 
Oh, come on. Is that going to reach? No, it's not going to reach. Of course it's not going to reach. Because the game cheats. Eh. Oh, man, that tail hammer thing. How does a monster form like that, anyway? A lot of these monsters have, like, these significant features. And you just wonder, like, how? What did... What did Earth do? What did they do to the Earths that... Oh, man, I don't even know how to word this. How... Ah! Where did that come from? How... How do you have to live on this Earth to get something like that? There! I said it! It's not what I really meant, but... What? Did somebody hurt you? Whoa! Oh man, this is getting intense. Don't. It's already been about 10 minutes. Come on, just die. You know you're weak. I know you're weak. Just stop. Maybe I should have like did full charges with the close range coatings and then worked on him with level 2 charges. That would have made more sense. Oh, come on. Oh, that tail! Come on, stop moving so much! Just die! It's inevitable! Oh, come on, I thought he was gonna, like, do that side shift. That! I thought he was gonna do that, but he didn't. Whoa, how many times did I, like, move? Come on. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> no. Yeah, you do that. Man, I hate this. Look, he's weak. I knew it. I knew this whole time. But he's just like holding on. Clearly not hitting the right spot. I did waste a lot of level 2 charges on its side. So, I don't know. Well, this episode's almost done. <laughs> we just gotta figure out how to kill it properly. Maybe with an arc shot? Are you serious? You're ridiculous. Don't even pull that crap. I, f I thought he was gonna hang out there and just be all weak and act like he doesn't know what the hell he's doing. Is that enough? No? One more full charge? No? That not enough? One more? This is so hard. Let's just use level 1s. Because I don't even... I'm getting impatient here. <laughs> that was not a good tactic. Don't do that. Not unless it's like a level 5 or 3. Where you get more... And if it's spread. <laughs> oh man, I swear if you die in the lava... I'm gonna be so mad. Wow, are you not dead? Oh... Just die. Oh man, are you serious? All these hits and it just doesn't want to die. How about that tail? No? Of course not. Wow, this is ridiculous. It's already going to be like 15 minutes. He's weak, weak. And he just won't die. This game makes no sense. It's like, don't make him limp unless he's literally one-fourth, one-fifth health left. Not even one fifth, like a tenth. Oh man, what what killed him? Why did I not get that kill? I'm mad. I don't even care if he's dead. I worked so hard on that and somebody took my kill. I hope it wasn't an interruptor, though I didn't see anything. I think it was Kayumba. Oh man, this fight. So, I don't know. That was, if anything, that was a test. Level 2 charges with a spread. Let's look at this. I'll probably do the math later. Is that spread level 3? If anything, it should have been faster. And, let's see. 1, 2, 3. Oops. 3. And then 
one, two, yeah, see, it's definitely faster over time. Anyway, thanks for watching. See ya.